everyone, and welcome back to Little Book's Great Stories. Today we're going to read, There was a black hole that swallowed the universe. Do you guys know what a black hole is? Well, a black hole is a really cool place in space where there's so much gravitational pull that nothing can escape it. Not even light. So let's read this book and follow the journey of an interesting black hole. Please make sure to subscribe to Little Book's Great Stories if you haven't already, like the video, and let's start reading. There was a black hole that swallowed the universe. There was a black hole that swallowed the universe. I don't know why it swallowed the universe. Oh well, it couldn't get worse. There was a black hole that swallowed a galaxy. It left quite a cavity after swallowing that galaxy. It swallowed the galaxies that filled the universe. I don't know why it swallowed the universe. Oh well, it couldn't get worse. There was a black hole that swallowed a star. It couldn't get far, that bright shining star. It swallowed the stars that lit up the galaxies. It swallowed the galaxies that filled the universe. I don't know why it swallowed the universe. Oh well, it couldn't get worse. There was a black hole that swallowed a planet. Very organic, this fine looking planet. It swallowed the planets that orbited the stars. It swallowed the stars that lit up the galaxies. It swallowed the galaxies that filled the universe. I don't know why it swallowed the universe. Oh well, it couldn't get worse. There was a black hole that swallowed a cell. It might get unwell after swallowing a cell. It swallowed the cells that gave life to the planets. It swallowed the planets that orbited the stars. It swallowed the stars that lit up the galaxies. And it swallowed the galaxies that filled the universe. I don't know why it swallowed the universe. Oh well, it couldn't get worse. There was a black hole that swallowed a molecule. It thought it was fuel, a big molecule. It swallowed the molecules that fed the cells. It swallowed the cells that gave life to the planets. It swallowed the planets that orbited the stars. It swallowed the stars that lit up the galaxies. It swallowed the galaxies that filled the universe. I don't know why it swallowed the universe. Oh well, it couldn't get worse. There was a black hole that swallowed an atom. It's hard to get at them, those tiny atoms. It swallowed the atoms that built up the molecules. It swallowed the molecules that fed the cells. It swallowed the cells that gave life to the planets. It swallowed the planets that orbited the stars. It swallowed the stars that lit up the galaxies. It swallowed the galaxies that filled the universe. I don't know why it swallowed the universe. Oh well, it couldn't get worse. There was a black hole that swallowed a neutron. A good start to build on. A neutral neutron. It swallowed the neutrons that stabled the atoms. It swallowed the atoms that built up the molecules. It swallowed the molecules that fed the cells. It swallowed the cells that gave life to the planets. It swallowed the planets that orbited the stars. It swallowed the stars that lit up the galaxies. It swallowed the galaxies that filled the universe. I don't know why it swallowed the universe. Oh well, it couldn't get worse. There was a black hole that swallowed a quark. That's all there was. And now it's dark. And here are some stellar black hole facts. You can't see a black hole because it doesn't reflect light. It actually pulls light in with its immense gravity. The place beyond which nothing can escape a black hole is called the event horizon. The center of a black hole is called the singularity, 
we might never know what happens there. Black holes warp space and time around them. To us, time appears to move much slower near a black hole. When two black holes collide, they send out waves of energy that stretch and squish space itself. Scientists believe there is a huge black hole at the center of every spiral galaxy, including our own Milky Way. Thank you so much for listening to today's story here at Little Books Great Stories. Please come back again next week for more. Thank you.